Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is CKT Chaotic. Today I'll be reading I Love You episode 15 to 16. I just showered, my feet are swollen, my hands are swollen, so I'm kind of not feeling so great. But let's go ahead and get started. Um, let's meet up. Meet up. Alright. I love you. I have a meeting in a few minutes, but I am free this upcoming Saturday. Would that work with your schedule? Saturday? Is that okay with you? Um, that would be perfect. Where shall we have this meeting? Um, what about Sunbucks Cafe inside K-Mall? Understood. Again, thank you, Miss Yu. I cannot stress my gratitude enough. Oh, oh my goodness. Shoot. The babies. Uh, bring the redhead with you. You mean Yongi? Yes. I'll try. See you Saturday. Phew, it's all over now. That was so nerve-wracking. Oh. <laughs> I can't believe this. Do you just set, set up Shanae with on a blind date with two guys? Mm. That was so bad. Just imagine how Shanae would react. Whatever. I'll just use this as a payback for the prank she pulled yesterday. She pulling pranks without me? What did she do? She had me and Rika thinking that she got drunk and went home with some random dude. Even the bartender w was in on it. Uh, there's no way she would pull, come up with a prank as mean as that. Oh, it wasn't her who thought of it. It was all that the redhead's idea. Oh my goodness. Kusuke, who were you talking to just now? Oh, Kusuke, who were you just talking to just now? It wasn't Yongi, was it? It would have been nice if you let me say hi to him. Ugh, it's none of your business. Okay. Are you free this Saturday, though? Sorry, I'm not. I have another meeting that day. What? No, you don't. Your assistant told me you were off that day. It's a private affair. My assistant has no knowledge of it. Oh, he is cold. And stop using my sister to pry. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a meeting to attend. Well, what about Sunday? Bye, Meg. Ugh, so mean. He always say my name in such a condescending manner. How are he and Yongi even related? Oh, oh, my little sister is calling. Oh, yeah. Alyssa, how's everything? Are you excited for tomorrow? Because I am. Do you want me to come over with some food? I know you're on a diet for the shoot, but we should celebrate. It's your debut after all. Park pastries. I should have deleted the call from her history before Shanae sees it. Wait, are you sure you want to go through with it? What do you mean? Shouldn't I cover my tracks? I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about the blind date. Too bad. I want my revenge. Ugh. Two burgers early in the morning sounded like a good idea at the time. Oh, what did I miss? Ah, Shanae, nothing. You missed nothing. By the way, are you free this Saturday? Yeah. Um, how come? Um, do you want to hang out at the K-Mall that day? Sure, why not? It's been so long since I last went. Why all of a sudden? Oh, nothing. We re never really go out much when we're together. It's always my house, Rika's, or the school. Okay, just remind me later in the week. I'll see you at school tomorrow. Of course, I'll see you tomorrow. And Minyuk, I'll message you later like usual. Don't forget the stuff you bought. They're in the fridge. Oh, right. Later, guys. So, why are you against the blind date? Are you perhaps jealous? Yeah, no. I'm just a little worried. 
Compared to her heart attack inducing prank, a blind date isn't that bad. I'm wary about the redhead. Why? Just because he came up with the mean spirited prank? You're overthinking things, big bro. Hmm. Maybe you're right. But can you do me a favor this Saturday? If you do continue this date, could you monitor it? You mean spy on her? Yes. And why? I just want someone there in case something goes wrong. Bring Rika with you, too, if she's not busy. Fine, but you better send me two presents next time like you did for Chanae. She's not here. Good. There. There you are. The board is waiting for you in the conference room. Assistance Chase. Sir, for any inconvenience I may have caused you. Not at all, sir. Is that folder for the meeting? Yes. It's mostly just briefing on the acquisition of K-Mall. K-Mall? Yes, sir. Uh, do you want me to look, at, look it over before you head to the meeting? Jace, who's that standing outside of the conference room? I don't remember him being part of the board. That's the K-Mall owner's son, Sang Cho Kim. Ugh. His father was just wanted him here to observe the meeting. Just to learn how things, these things work, I guess. Should I go introduce myself? I'm sure your father would be happy if you did. Sang Cho Kim. I'm Kusuke Hirahara. Pleasure to make your acquaintance. <laughs> Kusuke Hirahara. You mean the chairman's son? Great to finally meet you. How do you still look so fresh-faced? The party went on until early this morning. What's your secret? Uh, is he one of the jerks that was trying to roofie uh, Shanae? Uh, anyway, my father wanted to congratulate you and your family about the acquisition and the success of the last night's par last night's the party. I'll be lying if I said I enjoyed myself, though. Sorry to hear that. Don't worry. It wasn't a party that I found unenjoyable. I just had other plans that night. Is it? <gasps> Little buddy, what are you doing outside of the apartment? You know the landlady doesn't want you here. <laughs> Why are you looking at me like that? Oh, you must be hungry. I got a special treat for you, only for today. You should consider yourself lucky. I, ru I ruined two expensive suits in the span of two days, but guess what? I didn't need to pay for any of them. If I had to, you'd only be getting cheap kibble from me. Don't get too used to the salmon, though. It was on sale. You'd be getting your usual wet food after school. Speaking of school, my grades should be updated by now. I should check them online. Heh. <laughs> Nice. My grade didn't go down by much. Well, she's a smart kid. Looks like my chemistry teacher ended up carving the test. But that English grade, though. Oh. Yeah, that's really low. Wow. I really need to find myself a, an English tutor. I should head home and do some extra studying later and wash my hands. Ah, oh, fish stain. You want to help me study, little buddy? Come on, I'll sneak you into the apartment for today. We can all hang with Papa together. I'm back. Sorry, I took longer than expected. Papa? Are you in here? I got the stuff. What the? He's not in his room either. I should give him a call and ask where he is. Hey, Pa. Where are you? I came back from the store, but you weren't home. I got us some frozen hamburgers for the week. Uh, I could heat some up right now and we could watch your show while we eat. Little Buddy is here too. Oh, I'm sorry, honey. Uh, you have to eat without me. Without me. Uh, my boss couldn't ask me if I could help out at the facility. Someone called in at sick at the last minute and another quit. Uh, we could really use the extra money. I'm sorry. I hope you're okay with that. Of course, I'm okay. You don't need to apologize. I'd feel much worse if no one took the care of the residents. Atta girl. 
We'll spend time together after work gets settled. I guess I'll just record his favorite show on tape for him to watch when he's free later like always. Looks like it's just you and me for the rest of the day, little buddy. Fun fact. Assistant Jace is designed and named after one of my beloved patrons. Oh. That's really sweet. Alright, next one. Why would anyone want to be friends with you? Don't touch me. You shouldn't feel bad. Why would anyone want to be friends with you? Hearing those exact words coming out of a close friend's mouth, it sure takes me back. I wonder how she's doing. Well, I hope. Bing. Uh, I'm on my way to Sunbox at the K Mall now. See you soon. <gasps> I almost forgot. Oh no. Oh no. They sure like to show off his back. Calling Alyssa. Your call has been forwarded to an automated voice messaging system. Please leave a message after the tone. Bam. Oh. Okay. No. Sweetie, are you doing okay in there? I can hear you going at it in your uh at it with your punch bag. I'm okay, Nana. No need to worry. Your old, older brother came to pay you a visit, by the way. Do you want to ask him to leave for you? Thank you very much for the tea, Miss Lock Lachlan. Oh <laughs> you're very welcome. Are you sure you don't want anything to eat? I have some biscuits you might like in the cupboard. It's okay, Miss Lachlan. How's my brother? He doesn't come to out of his room. He doesn't want to come out of his room. Noel's not feeling quite well at the moment. Typical. I guess I'll just wait here until he feels better. I got time. Could you relay that to him? I'll tell him. You can't hide from me forever. I still got a while before I need to leave. Oi. Ah, finally, No has come out of hiding. Quit using my Nana as your messenger. What else was I supposed to do with you avoiding me? What do you want? I'm just here to visit my little brother, of course. Cut the bullshit. You never visit me unless father tells you to. What did he send you to check up on me again? Did he send you to check up on me again? I came here on my own free will. Is it strange for an older brother to visit his sibling? No, but it is strange for you to do it. I did want I did want to see you how what? I didn't want to see how you and Miss Lachlan were doing. I didn't want, want I did want to see. I did want to see how you and Miss Lachlan were doing. That's no lie. That was a tongue twister. Sorry guys, my brain just like short circuit there. I can tell your grandmother is worried about you. How long has it been since you got out? Four years, maybe five? I'll stop for today. I know you don't like to be re reminded of what happened back then. Oh, the reason why I really came here. Do you know Miss Shanae Yu? What about her? I'm meeting her at the Sunbucks in K Mall per her request. She also asked for your presence. You seem quite interested in her, so I thought you should know. Is it gonna go? Good. She's here. What are we doing again? Minyuk wants to, us to watch over Shanae. A little too worried if you ask me. You know how he is. I can't blame him after the incident during middle school. Uh, what's Shanae doing here anyway? She never goes out. I set her up on a blind date. With who? Michiko Kosuke Hirohara and his red-haired red buddy? 
<gasps> One of my dad's bosses? Maya, what the heck were you thinking? Shh, keep it down. We need to stay covered. Ooh, my bad. But how did you even manage to set them up? My dad tells me he avoids women and scares them away with a tiny spray bottle he carries around. Apparently, he owes Shanae a favor. And I choked real bad doing a prank call with Minyuk, okay? Ah, I think that's him right, uh, right there. He looks easy to tackle. But he's alone. My gosh, I hate it when I click down there. Uh, Miss Yu. Who the heck is this creepy looking dude? Hello there. May I help you with something, sir? I'm sorry, but I'm meeting with someone. That seat's taken. Ah, yes. Thank you for saving a seat for me. Huh? No, I didn't mean you. That's right, the mask. I'm sorry. Recognize me now? Q-tip. Q-tip? I'm afraid I don't ha have any with me at the moment. What are you doing here? You wanted to meet with me here. Huh? You called me shortly after we parted last weekend. Uh, no, I didn't. It is not your phone number. What the? That is my phone number. Maya, that little... Miss Yu, you asked me to bring Yoongi here with me. He's not able to make it today, and for that, I am sorry. However, I would like to know why you asked for him specifically. But before we continue, let me order us some food. My treat for taking away your tiramisu. It would be poor etiquette if we were to sit here without ordering something. He's so proper? Ms. Yu, what would you like to eat? Uh, you don't have to get me anything. As long as one of us orders something, it should be fine, right? Um, that would be very ungentlemanly if I were to eat while a lady sits and watches without anything. So what would you like? Recommend the <laughs> white chocolate raspberry cheesecake, luxuriously smooth and dense and with drizzle of velvety white chocolate shavings and raspberry puree with some delightfully and fluffy, fluffy whipped cream to top it off. Oh my God. Wow, he must be very passionate about dessert. There, I got us both white chocolate raspberry cheesecake and some coffee. <gasps> it's my favorite from the shop. I recommend it to my colleagues all the time when we come here. Why are you making that face? What's wrong? Do you not like cakes? Is it the coffee? Nothing's wrong with the food. Brings me here with this guy is what's wrong. All right then. Now, let's get back to business. You asked me to bring Yonggi along. I would like to know why. The damn Maya, she's going to bring out the killer in me if she keeps this up, I swear. Miss Yu. Miss Yu? Can you please tell me why you wanted me to bring him? I should probably just tell him. I'm terribly sorry about this. This is all a setup. Huh? My friend must have been impersonating me when she called to you last week. Is that so? You wasted your time coming here. I'm so sorry. How unfortunate. No need to pour apologies, though. There was no harm done. He looks <laughs> He looks like he's about to slap her. I am free today, so it doesn't really matter. What about you, Miss Yu? Do you have any other affairs to attend to? Uh, I don't think so. Why do you ask? Since we are here, we might as well continue with this meeting. I take it you haven't thought of a way for me to help you, correct? After all, you did say this was a setup. No, I haven't thought of anything. Honestly, I forgot about it. I'm sorry. Well then, why don't we just acquaint ourselves? I have a feeling we will be seeing each other more often, considering my little brother's fascination with you. Little brother? Yonggi, you know, the redhead. You guys are related? Yes, we are brothers. Asshole and Mr. Stalkers, brothers. Why did she draw him? Why did she draw uh, Yonggi like that? Oh my gosh. They look nothing alike. Maybe one of them is adopted? 
What's the matter? He looked puzzled. You and Mr. St- I'm, I mean, you and Yonggi, you're both brothers? How? You were not aware of that? No, why would I? Hold on. Do you even know anything about my family? You guys have money? And my friend's dad works for you? That's all you know. Look, I don't care about your family, okay? It's none of my business. I'm just trying to get ready for our college exams coming up and getting through high school. That's it. When and where did you meet my brother? Huh? Was it at the party? Okay, what is he doing now? Asking me a question? What is this? Interrogation? I see. It appears this all began because his friend had a crush on you. Yonggi can be a little too inquisitive? inquisitive sometimes. Especially if it involves his friend. I haven't eaten breakfast yet. This looks so good. I bet it tastes as good as it looks. <gasps> and being quite the brazen young lady that you are. Oh, <laughs> you only pique his interest further. He can have an odd taste in people sometimes. O-M-F-G. This is too good. How do you like the cake? Judging by the rate you ate it, you must have enjoyed it. I can order you another one. It's no trouble. You don't need to do it. You don't need to. I had better cakes than this. You don't like it? Nah. Such a shame. I recommend you go get your tongue checked. Excuse me? I am only worried about your health. I have not met a single person who has not enjoyed this cake. It's quite concerning. Maybe not everyone shares your opinion. Are you sure you are right? My family owns a hospital, remember? We can accommodate you. I'm perfectly healthy, but thank you for the offer. My taste buds are completely fine, so there's no need for me to go to see a doctor. There's whipped cream on your face. So what? Maybe I put it there on purpose. Maybe I wanted to give myself a mustache. Why? Is it bothering you? Here. Oh. Clean your face with that. If you can keep that handkerchief when you're done. You can keep that handkerchief when you're done. And yes, it was bothering me. You need to keep your face clean. Why didn't you just hand it to me? I didn't think you would take it. You seem like the stubborn type. How are you even able to put up with my antics? Any guy would have left me alone by now. I guess you have that in common with your brother. Seriously? You're here too? I just wanted my old life back. What's up, friend? Been a while, am I right? <laughs> Oh my gosh. Oh, this read is such a headache sometimes. So much going on. And they keep on running back. Like, they keep on going, like running into each other. Her friends keep on setting her up. It's just like, they're kind of like forced to always be in each other's lives now. So, goodbye old life, Shanae. All right, guys. I'm sorry for stuttering and messing up some of the words. I am very exhausted. But... I'm gonna do a couple more reads and then I will be done for the day. Oh, tired. All right, guys. I'll catch you guys next time. Bye.